Hey guys, so I just had parent teacher conferences. They were interesting. Basically, our school does like two days of parent teacher conferences, and you only have to go on for an hour. So, you know, that's it's good. It's good. And yesterday, I went to see Divergent. I'm not going to do like a review because I'm really bad at reviews, but. Um, it was a very good movie if you've read the books. Even if you haven't read the books, I'd recommend going to see it. Also, um, yesterday I went to the Bruno Mars concert. Okay, and also, whenever there's parent-teacher conferences, they have like this bookstore. So I got um, To Kill a Mockingbird by Harper Lee. And I think everyone knows this book. It is a classic and yeah it's a really beautiful cover like the kid swinging and like even the spine if you can see it is so beautiful just the way it like goes anyway today i am doing the i love spring book tag so let's get into it question one how is spring where you live so it's spring right now and i live on the equator i live in thailand so right now it's, let me check, okay so it's 1 o'clock here and it's 32 degrees so it's pretty hot and it pretty, pretty much stays that way the whole year so yeah. Okay question two, most anticipated book release this spring? I think mine is um, the one which is the third book in the selection series and I am so excited for that book. Literally, I've been waiting. I was like, I've been part of that fandom for like so long. I remember when the Elite came out last year and it was just such a beautiful moment for me. Just kidding. And yeah, okay. Number three, show us a book cover that makes you think of spring. Let's see. So for this, I chose Forgotten by Cat Patrick. And this is a really good book, but um, I chose this because it has, you know, the poppies, and yeah, it's really nice. Four, where are you going to read this spring? Mm, right, right over here in my room, in my bed, on the floor maybe. Find a cover with a sun on it. Well, bonus round for finding a cover with the sun and the moon. See, here's the sun. This is The Puzzle Ring by Kate and she came to my school um, went in a long time ago but yeah here's the sun here's the moon on the back there's also the sun and the moon and on the spine so very good book if you're looking for historical fantasy yeah it smells really bad it's like a really old book so yeah Yes. Okay. S number six. What are your favorite spring reads? Um, the same as Reagan for this question. I don't really change what I read throughout the year, especially because it's always hot for me. Like, I don't really change the books I read. Maybe I'll read more like easy books in the summer, so I can sort of you know have that sort of summer vibe. You know, summery books, not easy books, but like more like fun, upbeat novels that like. I don't really change my reading, like what I read. Okay, seven, find a book with as many different colors. Okay, I am picking Harry Potter and the Chamber of Secrets, and I have the UK covers. So these basically have lots of different colors on them, as you can see. Look at the spine, it's all colorful. Okay, and then the last question is question eight, and it's who do you tag? I tag um, Elad from her channel, it's called Elad Shulman because, you know, the new YouTube thing. And then I also tag Josefa from Josefa Ruz. And they both started new YouTubes, they are both doing booktube, so you guys should definitely check them out if you're interested in those sorts of videos because that's what they're doing and they are my friends, like, in real life instead of online. So, yeah! Um, Bye!